These wise words of the day. If you don't eat your nutter butters like this, then you're just uncultured. I don't know what's wrong with you. What's good, y'all? It's your boy Fee keeping it G, and we are back with another Dragon Ball Legend video. Now, in today's video, I kind of want to start doing my character concepts, like you know I said before. And to pop things off, I'm just gonna start with Majin Vegeta because it would be like the most likely character to be coming up next, even though we kind of got like you know a little surprise because Lord Shield and Super Saiyan Bardock is coming soon. But that's going to be an Ultra Space Time banner, so we don't know what's going to be the Legends Rising banner before, but without further ado, let's get straight to it. Alright, so before I start, actually, if you see me looking down a lot, it's because like, I actually have it written down. And the reason for that is because um, I was actually like, you know, trying to do research, like re-watching shows and stuff like that. Uh, not shows, like, yeah, like the episodes of like when the characters appear, for example, Super Saiyan 2. Uh, Goku, Majin Vegeta, etc, etc, Final Fantasy Cooler. I watched the whole movie over again so, so I wouldn't miss like any little details. And I think I've like... I summed up some stuff. I don't really have like, you know, I didn't go too deep as into saying how much health they're gonna have, how their like, count for strike and blast damage and defense and all that stuff. But I did like kind of try to guess the basics as to what I think it might be. For example, um... Uh, I believe that Majin Vegeta, he's going to be a range, I mean, not range type, he's going to be a melee type because, for starters, we have no melee type Vegeta. I was going to say the, um, the, uh, red Super Saiyan Vegeta, but that's technically a defense type, even though he does, like, prioritize melee damage because of his main ability, but it's not really a melee focused, melee, melee, melee focused, whatever. It's not really a strike focused character, but I believe this Majin Vegeta, he's going to be a melee type. He's going to be a blue because we have no blue Vegetas. And another thing, I feel like he's going to bring a strike and a blast, you know, to keep it balanced. Uh, to start off, his tags, I believe they will be Super Saiyan 2, Saiyan of course, and then the Vegeta family, you know, keeping the basic. I was going to say Majin, I was going to add that to the list, but... Since there's no like Majin, Majin tags, and you know because your Majin Buu doesn't have one, the board doesn't have a Majin tag, etc., etc. So I just kept it those three simple, and I said, I said, yeah, Super Saiyan 2, right? Yeah, Super Saiyan 2, just like Team Gohan, he has a Super Saiyan 2 tag. And so I've been seeing like some people's, you know, guesses at like some people, like uh, some units, for example, Super Saiyan 3 Goku, someone was like Super Saiyan 3, Super Saiyan 2, Super Saiyan 1. That's stupid. It's not going to do that. It's just going to be one Super Saiyan form. It's going to be two, for example, because that's what he went. That was the most iconic, you know, transformation of that whole thing. So, yes, I believe those are going to be his tags. Another thing uh, for his special, special move, I feel like it's going to be Atomic Blast. And if you don't know what that is, I'm going to... It's going to be shown on the screen. I had to bring some examples from Xenoverse 2 if you don't know what that game is. I, I feel like you should you should know because, you know, it's, it's really popular. But I brought in examples from that because that's the best way for me to show anyone, like, what I'm talking about without getting copyrighted and, like, pulling it from this, like, you know, just stupid stuff like that, YouTube stuff. But it's, I feel like it's going to be Atomic Blast. It's going to be the thing that makes the most sense because I was watching, as I was watching the whole fight, even between him and Goku and him and Majin Buu, he never used Big Bang Attack. He used the, um, the, you know, the volley of Key Blast that he always does. I forgot what it was called. But he uses that. He never used Big Bang. He never used Final Flash. And technically, the thing he used to keep Goku Prison, I don't know what it's called, but it's not technically a move move. So that's going to be his special move to me. Uh, when it comes to ultimates, of course, I feel like it's going to be, you know, his main ability is going to be a draw the ultimate card, uh, final explosion, because, you know, why would it be, why would we have Majin Vegeta and not have final explosion? It wouldn't make sense. But when it comes to final explosion, I feel like it's going to be a move where, like, of course, it's going to be a self-suicide move. 
so he's going to kill himself, but he will also add a 20% buff to Blast and Strike for his teammates, and then he will also regain 30, 30 key, and I feel like that's pretty fair. You know, uh, for timer counts, like the buff is going to be probably like, I would say 20, 15 seconds, because I would say 15, honestly. 15 is actually a long, good amount of time. For people who know how to play in PvP, they can they know how to use the time well, but if not 15, then it's going to be 20. Those are the two most likely to make sense. But, that's going to be all. I'm going to try to keep these shorts like, I'm going to have examples for some green cards for some units. Because I can't, it's really just basic stuff, you know, it could be a damage buff or, like, for example, my, my initial, my initial green card ability for Majin Vegeta was going to be an inflict damage buff and, like, shoot, I don't know, like, extra damage to his final explosion. But, you know, that's basic and some people will have basic stuff. I'm going to have a lot more of these in the future. Like, for example, I have one for hit and his is going to be, like really good especially his green card I don't know why I can't wait for it like it's gonna happen but I just if it does happen I can see what my guesses were to be like coming into existence more and it's gonna be more believable than you know some just like you know out of the out of the fucking box OP ass character but yes I'm gonna have more uh, I'm gonna try to keep these short as possible not really like short short but like I'm gonna just I want to get straight to the point uh, say what I think is gonna, you know, just my thoughts on how it's gonna be. It might be true, it might not be true, you never know. It's always a guessing game when it comes to this stuff. Like, even in V-Jump scans, they have, like, the colors of the units. Like, for example, Chilled has purple, but it might not be, he might not be a purple unit. It's just, uh, you know, just, just throwing it out there. But yeah, that's gonna be the end of today's video. Uh, I hope you guys enjoy it, and if you have any, like, guesses you wanna throw down, leave them in the comments down below. Uh, like the video if you enjoyed this like kind of series I'm gonna do it's not really like a series series but it's like a it's something I want to do because I have a lot of thoughts and I just want to like tell people so leave a like uh, if you enjoy it dislike if you don't enjoy it make sure to subscribe if you're not subscribed already and I'll catch you in the next one I'm Groovy Fee and I love you all peace Bye.